and thanks for tuning into the channel. Check these views. I'm on a wild camp tonight. Back in North Wales. Stunning views across the sea there. Conway Mountain. And across to Anglesey. Yeah, I'll just show you these abandoned World War II buildings here. This is the first one I've come across. Looks like an old starry dream or something. Yeah, this is part of an old military training school. An old gun site. There's quite a lot of abandoned buildings around here. The plan is tonight is to find shelter in one of the World War II buildings. I haven't brought a tent with me. But I've brought my bivvy bag. Yeah, so I'll be using the Alpkit Hunker XL bivvy bag. And my sleeping bag. And I brought a ground sheet as well, so hopefully I'll find some shelter in one of the buildings. So this is the second one I've come across. I'll take you through this one. This one's all overgrown. Here's the entrance here, so I'll walk through. It's going to be dark inside. So I'm not sure what that one was used for. Uh, pitch black inside. So it's a lovely day today. Stunning. Another three buildings here, and what a view as well. Angle C in the distance, Conway Mountain, the kind of die mountains in the background. Then further on, you've got the mountain to Snowdonia, and this is the Irish Sea. Beautiful location. I think back in the day when these were in use, I think they would have had. A target anchored out at sea. So we have got a shelter in mind that I'm going to try and find in a minute. But if all else fails, I'll come back to this spot and I'll choose one of these to spend the night in tonight. Then I'll just choose the cleanest one. It is supposed to rain overnight and in the morning, so making the most of this lovely day today.
just make out the last pillbox now. This is right on the tip of the arm, high up on sea cliffs here. Lovely sea views. Hopefully get a nice sunset as well tonight. Fingers crossed anyway. What an amazing spot this is. Stunning sea views. And this is home for the night. A World War II pillbox. Right on the top of sea cliffs. Right, then I'll show you the inside. Got steps to get in. We've got a little seat as well. Check out the views from inside. It's blue sea. And the sunset's gonna be right here. Doesn't get any better than this. So what's on the menu tonight? Mushroom and truffle pasta. And some fresh broccoli. Sweet corn with peppers. And a flavour bomb of chilies, paprika, white pepper and salt. Washed down with a hazy jane. Well, I've took the healthy option tonight. Mushroom and truffle pasta with broccoli, sweet corn, peppers, chilies, paprika, white pepper, black pepper. Yeah, it looks nice and filling as well. I've just had a taste, it's delicious. Nice kick from the chilies as well. Yeah, so I'm going to enjoy this now. Enjoy the view. Not a bad spot. Looks like there's a sightseeing boat going past. Probably thinking about that madman doing up there just before sunset. I don't think there's going to be much of a sunset tonight. Stunning view though.
and peaceful up here now. Just enjoying the beer, chilling out. So this is the inside of the pillbox. I've just spent a good 10 minutes trying to move all the stones and glass. There's loads of glass in here. So I'll be surprised if my camping mat doesn't go down tonight. This camera probably won't make it out, but you can just see the whole floor's glistening. A tiny shards of glass. I have got most of it up, but it only takes one and it'll go through the ground sheet, no problem. So hopefully I'm gonna I'm gonna put me camping mat here long ways. Hopefully they've got rid of all the glass or most of the glass. And the camping mat will survive the night. And it just makes you wonder. All the people that have been in there through the years. Especially when it was part of the artillery training school. Good morning. It's a damp and cold one this morning. The shelter did its job last night. It got quite windy in the night, but nice and sheltered from the wind in here. It's just starting to rain now, so I'm going to get packed up and make my way back. We set up. It was just the help kit, Hunker XL, with Unigear sleeping mat and the Robins Serac down sleeping bag. It was warm enough last night. You can just make out Puffin Island in the distance there, Conway Mountain. We actually did a wild camp on there last year, in an old abandoned quarry, which I might return to. 